hi everyone welcome to the channel and another video of interesting fact hope everyone is fine yes so let's start without wasting anyone's time and this time let's talk about planets yeah yeah correct celestial objects the planets the solar system uh, it's quite bizarre and uh, everyone's quite interesting to know about like what lies above the above in the sky so let's start okay so presenting you the first fact that's like on uh, our neighboring planet mars okay the first fact is the sunset on the mars appears to be blue oh did you know that yes it does appear to be blue so actually the martian sunset typically stands out for their distinctive blue color this fact is attributed to the mars atmosphere the atmosphere pressure is equivalent to about one percent of earth and it's made of carbon dioxide and has a lot of dust this fine dust when tends to scatter red light so that's why the sky appears reddish and which lets the blue light through so it's just other way around what our planet earth is so on earth it is the another way around so that is blue light bounces off the air molecule giving our sky its characteristic blue color so it's quite a gruesome fact uh, okay let's move towards our second interesting fact and it would be on the planet which are far away from earth so like it is it won't be possible to walk on the planets like jupiter neptune saturn and uranus yeah it's impossible to walk over these planets just like when you walk over earth you won't be able to find it possible to walk on the surface of the planets have you ever thought why any guesses if not let me just tell you that there isn't any land there <laughs> yes not at least in the convention sense of what you are familiar with here on earth yes correct the core which is made mostly of solid but then that's the core and center of the planet so when you just land on the planet you will tend to swim just like uh, in a swimming pool you won't be able to place your feet on any surface on any rock solid and you'll just swim and then in fact when you will be able to reach the core you would be crushed by the pressure of gases so that's why nobody will be able to reach the core of these four planets jupiter neptune saturn and uranus so that's a really a great thing okay now coming over to the fact number 3 let's again talk about neptune now when we say neptune or when we just think of neptune the planet is actually very far yes it's quite far neptune is 30 astronomical units far away from sun yeah and one astronomical unit is equal to distance of earth from the sun that is 30 times farther the distance between earth and sun and because of this it gets only about 0.1% of solar energy that reaches the earth if suppose it reaches a 100% then it would be just 0.1% of that and the bizarre thing or the most interesting thing it that it still radiates 2.6 times more energy than it receives from the sun which means that It's radiating more, and it's like it's very complicated. So something that it has the own, it has their own internal energy, and but we still don't know what or where this is or how it provides so much heat. Hmm. 
so it's very interesting and now let's come over to the fact number four well this time it's about saturn the scientists believe that the because of extreme heat and pressure inside saturn it can cause carbon to crystallize into giant diamonds yeah you heard it right i said diamonds these diamonds would then get blown around by the gas giant's powerful wind and can then also result in what is called as saturn's diamond rain yeah <laughs> diamond rain so next time when you don't have diamonds and you want to purchase diamond just visit saturn and in the rain you can collect the diamonds and you can become rich <laughs> yes and now coming to our last fact fact number 5 let's again revert back to our neighbor planet mars ever thought about growing planet on mars if you're thinking about then then let me tell you that you'll be disappointed after hearing this after the sample probes collected of the soil sample scientists discovered that the soil on the mars is highly toxic for plants yes it's a with a ph rating of 7.7 uh, 0.6% per chlorate content scientists concluded that the martian soil would kill any earth planet that tried to grow on it mm, yes but there's a good news as well and that is scientists also considered the possibility that the toxic soil sample may just be a local accretes so if so other parts of the mars might have soil that is more com- capable of supporting life so you have to just search which part of mars is able to grow plants and you can just grow your plants and cultivate your field there so that was our five important and interesting facts regarding planets hope you have found out our video good in the case just gives us a thumbs up and if you want to give us a feedback just comment below thank you thanks everyone bye bye